there hopefully to see things um, that normally we wouldn't be able to see um, in regular circumstances. describable because it's just something that I feel so powerfully um, just walking through the streets I just feel uh, an amazing connection to God like there's a direct path and I in particular am looking forward to having time with her alone um, when she's healthy We had a pretty hard year last year and uh, we're just here because we're just so grateful. And God's presence is definitely here and we just want to give thanks. And to have fun and to know that she's healthy and everybody's going to be the same and we are going to continue. our home and this is we should feel at home and this is yeah this is our home. Israel, where, where the Jewish people belong, it's really, really amazing, and there's a spirit and the certain style of life here that doesn't compare to, to anything else that I've ever seen or felt, and just walking through the country and seeing everything, it's really amazing. Privilege to have our children well enough that we can make a long trip like this, and for us, it's the first time to Israel. And uh, you read a lot about a place, and you can't imagine that it could actually it's be that not, way. And you get not. here, and it is. Uh, it's a special place, and you can see that just by the people on the street and the way they talk to each other, and the people in our group. It makes it that much more special. It's about meeting new people. Uh, it's about seeing Israel for the first time, and you know, developing a passion for the land for the people here and seeing the, the cultures here and how people live their lives. I really just felt amazingly invigorated. I just felt, I don't know, I feel really good. I feel much different. I feel like there's a whole world like ahead of me. I just feel really good about everything and I just feel like I appreciate everything more. It's, it's, a very, it's very nice to be able to see other people who went through the same thing or similar things and to know that they also had the strength to go through it and that gives me more strength to go further. Even though he was someone sick, he could still enjoy himself after and still be a regular person and enjoy himself. It was a journey. It was a journey for people going beyond themselves, or going into themselves, and, and for discovering things that they never knew about themselves before. And it was something that uh, was unique, a diverse family that came together, and there's, there's nothing in between them, and there's, there's no wall separating them. A lot of times when someone goes through um, cancer or something, um, they get closed in a little bit. 
they, they, they shut themselves, they, they close themselves in and they, they build their own like little shell and they don't really come out of it a lot of times. I think part of part of being with people who went through experience like you, I mean, there's no like self-consciousness or like you don't feel weird or awkward about your situation. I mean, you, you feel you can talk openly and you can you can you can really establish uh, bonds, very very strong bonds with with people here because they they know what you've been through. You know what they've been through. We don't even we don't we didn't even know each other before the trip, and all of a sudden, because we have that we have that initial bond of that we've both been through the same thing, we, we already know each other in a sense. Rusha!